Hi everyone, welcome back to Rocket Guys. Today I'm going to go over one investment that you can make and some of the best ways of trading with examples where people are making so much profit. Before we get started, if you're ever looking for some discounted Rocket League items and credits for much cheaper than the item shop, head over to RL Exchange. They offer the most reliable place to buy loads of different tradable items like Phoenix, White Dracos and even Alpha Cap. They can deliver items to any platform and you can pay with loads of different payment methods. And with a 5 star Trustpilot rating, they are sure to have any items you could want. Check out RL Exchange from the link in the description and use code GUYS at checkout to get 3% off every purchase. So you all know about flipping items, where you buy one item for cheap and sell it on for more. Well, if you come across someone who is selling multiple items, which you often find on RL Garage or RL Trade in Post, you can offer them some credits for all the items they're selling and buy them in bulk. A lot of the time when you do this you can get some nice discounts because you're saving them the hassle of having to sell each one individually. So when you usually buy items for 50 under minimum, you might be able to buy 5 items all around the same price for a total credit value that is 80 or 100 under minimum for each one. I have a good example of this from Blingle who bought 4 different painted octanes for a total of 1100 credits. This worked out to be 150 under min for each one of those octanes. If he takes his time and sells each one of them for mid price, he will make around 800 credits profit just from that one trade. You don't just have to do this with octanes though. You can use any other items that are in high demand like black markets and fenix and things like that. Don't go bulk buying items like rocket pass things or even RLCS items because they have a much smaller demand on the market and can be a pain for you to sell and you probably won't make much profit. So stick to the high demand items. I just want to quickly mention that on Saturday at 7.30 GMT, which is UK time, I am helping out with a mini game on our partner Discord server, Easy Trades. There will be multiple rounds and for each round, you will all have the chance to win a free item. The game is called What's That Item? And as you can probably guess, you will have to guess what the item is to win the prize. So the link to Easy Trade server is in the description and be sure to come along and play for the chance to win some free items. A lot of people forget about this item, but it is one of the best items I've used that can make you profit early on and it is the Painted Halos. Because some of these are so cheap, you can only really buy them for 50 credits under minimum, but they will often sell for mid price. So as well as flipping the cheaper black markets and painted octanes, you can buy and sell some halos for an easy 100 credits profit here and there. However, the black, white and crimson variants are worth a decent amount more, so you can buy them for a little more under minimum and make extra profit from them. I have an example from Ismail who bought a white halo and got a couple exotics on top of that. He got all these items for 820 credits and can easily sell the halo alone for more than that, and then he'll still have two exotics left over, so this is a really nice trade. Now, I'm sure all of you know that, on Monday, the white Dominus was added to the item shop and so has decreased in price. Exactly one hour after this video goes live, it will be taken out the item shop. As I'm recording this, it hasn't dropped too badly, but I suspect that it will decrease more before you all watch this video. There is a common trend in this game, where when expensive items are in the shop, they drop in price, but when they're out the shop, they gain some of their value back again. So, when the item shop is updated, in an hour after this video is uploaded, the white Dominus will no longer be in the shop, and if it has dropped a significant amount between me recording this and uploading this, it will be a great short term investment for you all to make. If you do decide to invest in this, make sure you're ready to sell it, because items that have just been in the shop can often go all over the place, so just be ready. If you enjoyed the video or found it helpful, please consider subscribing with notifications on. And if you want to support us, use code RLTPRICES in the item shop for a huge Donner Kebab.